Morning everyone, I hope you're well. I hope you had a good weekend. It was actually Father's Day yesterday, so yeah, we had a bit of quality time with Graham, which was really nice. Um, the weather's been really good as well, so yeah, today's Monday, I think it's 16th. Yeah, 16th. And um, yeah, I suppose it's the start of my weekly vlog. And I'm glad you're enjoying these. They're actually really nice to do because it's not a full day, so I don't feel exhausted trying to get my camera out all the time because sometimes it can be difficult and trying to remember but yeah um i'm literally me and alistair are the only two up uh it's 20 past seven i need to get a move on i'm literally in the process of doing breakfasts i'll show you actually so <laughs> lunch boxes picnic me and violet are going off for a picnic today so i'm doing literally everything i'm doing breakfasts at the same time as well it just makes sense really so i'm just need to get a move on and get um school lunches and everything done um so then i can obviously get the kids ready get myself ready and head on the school run we've got like basically an hour which isn't that long actually is it hi monkey you okay what would you like for breakfast I get there. Me up there. Yeah. I think Violet's working her way over. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Hello. Hello, sleepyhead. Oh dear. She's like, leave me alone. Hi everyone. So I've done the school run and I've actually come into sort of Southampton. I promised Violet we'd go to Peppa Pig World just because we haven't been there in a few weeks and before the school kids break up um, it's best to go because it's just not busy, it's nice and quiet and um, we probably, likelihood when it's summer holidays we probably won't end up going because one, we might go once actually but one I'll have to pay for Alistair which will be £26 every single time which obviously just gets stupidly expensive. So. Um, yeah, uh, we're headed, we're actually going to have the car cleaned first, I really need it done. I'm not having the inside done though, I'm literally just going to have the outside done because I really need to sort out the inside, it's such a mess. I think I'm just going to hoover hoover the inside myself, um, either today or tomorrow. So we're going to get our car cleaned quickly and then we're going to head to Peppa Pig World, it's ten past nine, so it's bright and early and Violet is super excited aren't you? to be going to Peppa Pig World. She's itching to go there. We have made it and we're literally like the third people in. So that's exciting. So we're gonna get on all the rides really fast, aren't we, Vi? It's totally dead. No one's on the rides yet. So I think we're gonna to head to the dinosaur ride. We're just having a quick snack in soft play because the rides don't actually open till half past. 10 and it's like 20 past now. Are we on the boat? Bye. We're we gonna go. Are we gonna go? Yeah. yeah. We're on the pink and red one, aren't we? Yeah. Whee! Is that good? Is that good? Okay. Yeah. Beep beep. Violet beep. Come the We spent over an hour in Peppa Pig so we thought we'd um, have a little wander around Poulton's Park it's only obviously in the same place but we don't usually go in here that often so we're gonna look at the birdies they've got some nice enclosures haven't they Vi? I bought the pushchair today I wouldn't usually bring it but um I don't know I thought it might be a bit more convenient since we're like walking around Potts Park it's pretty huge like to even get around it so it's half past 11 we're gonna sit down and have a picnic soon it's really overcast it's, it's a little bit chilly actually and I've got my legs out but never mind <laughs> I think we're gonna sit here and this is quite new this but I haven't noticed this bit before but it's really cool this is the dinosaurs I think we're gonna have our picnic here one of these tables shall we just having our little mini picnic. I made some um, cheese scones last night, so we're having those. So, so nice. I'll leave the recipe below. I, um, I managed to get my car clean, just the outside. I really wanted to get the inside done, and the bloke was just, because <laughs> it kind of cleaned the inside of your doors. 
And as soon as he opened it, he said to me, are you sure you don't want your, the inside of your car done? I was like, oh, I probably should, but I'm not going to, because it just means that here, it probably won't get the thorough job it needs because there's so much stuff in the car. Um, but it's nice and clean on the outside, so that's good because I haven't had it done since I had my service, which was a good month and a half ago. Just having some climbing time in the sand. Mm, have a tea. Your cup of tea? I'll have a cup of tea. Can I have a cup of coffee, actually? Violet! Is it good? Are you driving? Boing. Well done. Good morning, everyone. I hope you're well. I um, I've already done school run. Just got home. It's actually I've been home about ten minutes. It's ten past nine, and I'm just going to do a quick violet wash. Yep, you can help me. Um, because I need to do some washing today. It's really nice today. The sun's actually out. It's not too overcast, which is good. Okay, Riley's going to do her washing, which is handy. Saves me the job, doesn't it, Missy? Ah. <laughs> Where's he gone? Oh, he's on the floor again. Uh-oh. Cheeky spider. Mm -hmm. Bye. Bye. Let me do. Yay. Good boy. Is that yummy? So I'm just quickly going to Hoover the house, get that done, um, and then I haven't really got anything else to do, like in the housewise. I finished my ironing last night, I've basically caught up on all my chores apart from I've got Violet's washing that's just gone into the washing machine, I've got a whitewash to do today, but it doesn't matter if I don't get that done, I can just do it tomorrow. But um, yeah, I just want to hoover the house and then we're actually going to go out for the day. We're going to go to, down to Boscombe Beach and have lunch there because I just thought, why not? It's such a nice day. Yeah. Ready? Then do the extra boost. There we go. She's doing everything today, aren't you? Okay, the house is hoovered. Violet's already outside. I actually need to just get the lambs some milk and we need to feed them before we go. It's quarter to ten. Um, yeah, sun is shining. I managed, I actually changed my shirt. I changed it to another shirt and then I put my shorts on. I don't know if you can see them, but I've got my yellow shorts on. Kind of beachy. <laughs> what have you got? Feathers. Feathers. Oh, you got lots and lots. Should we feed the lammies quick before we go? Thirsty lammies. So we've just parked, I've just got my ticket, um, I've paid up to just after two. Um, I actually don't have to do the school run because Alistair has been invited around one of his friends for tea. So that's really good, it saves me driving down there. I'm not sure if I'm going to have to pick him up though. My friend's got a little one year old so, and her husband works in Southampton so I'm not sure if she'll want me to go pick him up, I don't really mind but yeah I won't have to do a three o'clock school run so that's good. So yeah, it's absolutely lovely, it's boiling. Violet's just had like a mini, mini power nap. And yeah, we're gonna head down to the beach. I've brought her scooter with me so she can have a little scoot um, and just have a nice little run. She's so fast. <laughs> Aren't you? You're a pro. these cool beach houses it's one that's what I want one day I will own one one day <laughs> and we'll be here all the time won't we Vi we'll be at the beach all the time I'm going to go to the beach. yeah you want to go on the sand we're just gonna find a toilet I think we're gonna play on the sand for a few minutes it's time it's half past ten and then we're going to get some brunch at Urban Reef because that's like our favourite sort of restaurant. It's so lovely. If you haven't been there, it's literally on Boscombe uh, Seafront, right near the pier, um, to the left of the pier. And it's just amazing. There's colour colouring. Is that nice? Good pancake? I've got this in there. There's berries. Do you like berries? That's mine. Do you like berries, bye? 
That's it, dip it in. Violet's filling her shells up with sand. You filling them up? Where's your feet gone? Where have they gone? Here. Yeah, they're hiding. I could seriously sit here all day and go to sleep. Should we go have a little nap? I think we could, we should have a little nap, really. I'm just so peaceful and tired and sleepy. <laughs> so nice. We're going to go paddle our feet, aren't we? Yeah? Yeah, I've reached the sand Yeah. She hates it still. It's so lovely. I obviously haven't got my feet in. Still total. Totally frightened of it. Hopefully she'll grow out of it as she gets older. Don't you? Because Alistair is like utterly obsessed with the sea. He would just run straight in. But she's always been really frightened. So I don't even know why. Because she loves the bath. She loves the pool. But she hates the sea. Is it scary? It's scary. Don't know why. It's lovely. It's very cold though. We've um, just come back to the car because by us getting a bit tired, obviously I forget sometimes that she is actually only two and a half and she has got tiny little legs and she's getting tired. She's done a lot of scootering and walking. So I'm going to get pushed her out and I wouldn't be surprised if she has a little power nap in there. And we're going to walk along the pier and maybe even get an ice cream. I think it's half past 12 now. <laughs> Morning everyone. I'm literally just watching the kiddies out in the field. Um, yeah, it's Wednesday and I left you actually yesterday at Boscom and we went down to the pier but my camera actually died so I didn't get to show you the beautiful view we had a lovely sort of stroll along the pier and then it got really hot Violet was getting irritable and she wouldn't nap in her push chair which I knew she wouldn't do so we ended up coming back home she napped in the car for a good like 40 minutes to an hour we didn't have to do school run because obviously Alistair was at um, his friend's house for tea I didn't pick him up till half six um, and that just felt really, really strange in itself. Um, but he had a great time. He was absolutely exhausted when he got in. He literally had a quick shower and then straight into bed, which was kind of good in a way, you know, he kind of went to bed at a really good time and he basically worn himself out. So um, yeah, me and Violet pretty much when we got home, when she woke up, we just chilled by the pool. We had an ice lolly and yeah, that was pretty much our evening. Um, yeah, today's Wednesday. The, for some reason, it's looking really gloomy today. The kiddies, you probably can see them. They are here. Um, it's supposed to be a really nice day. It's looking like pretty overcast at the moment. I'm hoping it's going to warm up. Um, but it's Wednesday, so that means Violet's actually at nursery till half past one, and Alice is obviously at school. So I'm going to quickly go and do the school run, nursery run, and then I'm actually going to do food shopping. I'm going to head down to Costco because I really fancy prawns. And they, they do like a massive, huge bag of like jumbo king prawns for such a good price. So I'm going to get some prawns and probably some grapes and see what else I pick up. And I'm also going to go to Morrison's because Morrison's is actually um, kind of near Costco. So I'm going to do my groceries in there today. Um... So that's the plan. I'm literally going to do the school run and then go straight to groceries. So I'm already ready. Hopefully my face isn't looking too orange. I'm actually using a new BB cream, which is super light. But I was kind of umming and ahhing about the colour. I was looking at it on my hand thinking, oh my god, it's really orange. But I think on my face, I might actually have got away with it. Hopefully. Um, so yeah, I am literally just going to grab all the bags and we're going to head on the school run. Right, off we go. In the car. Ready? Ready for nursery? Yeah. Okay, ready for school? Plug my food to it. Please. Please. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, ready? Let's go. Hi everyone. So I'm heading over to Morrison's. I'm going to Morrison's first because um, um, Costco actually doesn't open till 10 and there's no point hanging around. I mean, I usually hang around, but that's because Violet will usually obviously nap. So 
yeah, I'm heading to Morrison's because it opens at nine. It's nearly quarter past nine now. I've done the school run, done the nursery run. I'm going over the forest now. If you don't listen to um, Heart Radio, I don't know if it's just in the south actually, but Heart Radio, they do kind of like time tunnel, which they do every morning. And oh, it's just amazing. They literally just play a whole batch of like songs from a certain era and it's just it just puts me in such a good mood every single morning listening to it um because it just gives you like blasts from the past of like different memories of different songs songs i haven't like listened to in like decades you know i love it i'd highly recommend listening to heart radio because it's just puts me in such a good mood i love it okay morrison's done now off to costco oh god i love morrison's they're just so good for everything I got um, kind of distracted by some of their clothes and got the kiddies a couple of outfits, well actually an outfit each, for like £8 each, it's so cheap, you'll see it in my haul anyway, but oh, I just love Morrison's, they have such good offers and the produce is always so good. So yeah, it's um, 20 past 10, heading to Costco, it's still really overcast. Um, I don't really need much in Costco, so I'll probably just pick up a couple of things. I might even stop off at my mum's on the way back as well, because it would be nice to see her, because she's actually off this week. Actually, you know what? I'm going to get my mum now, on the way, <laughs> see if she wants to come, because I guarantee I will ring her after Costco, and I'll be like, I've just been at Costco, mum, and she'll be like, well, why didn't you bring me? Well, I've just got home. I've had a busy, busy morning, afternoon. I actually went to Costco with my mum, then we went to my brother's house afterwards. My brother's actually at work, but my brother's other half was there, obviously. She works from home being a childminder. And we just sat, had coffee and cake. I haven't actually had a proper lunch. I've literally just got back after picking up Violet. It's quarter past two. Crazy, crazy. I'm gonna have to get Alistair in a minute, but I really need to put away all of this. So, yes, I just need to sort out the chaos. And then we're gonna go get Alistair. Like I said, it's quarter past two. I'm really hungry, actually. I think I'm gonna find something to eat as well before I leave. Just come see the piggies, see how they're doing. They always tip over their water, always, don't you? You need some more water now, won't you? Bet you're hot and bothered. Look at his tail. <laughs> oh, it's so cool. He's stroking his bum. <laughs> you're funny. Shut the gate. Shut the gate, why? I'm gonna go under. You wanna go under? Okay, it's all shut. Come in. Yeah. Let's do under. <laughs> you want to go under? Yeah. Right, let's get them some water, shall we? <laughs> they love a good mud bath. It's so hot, isn't it? Girls and boys, huh? Right, well, I think they're happy. They're like, yeah. Nice and cool. There's Miss Piggy. Miss Piggy! Piggy! Shut, leave me alone. Time to wash hands. Violet, come on! It's a cheeky little thing over there. Yeah, time to wash hands. Oh, all dirty now. And go get the boy from school. Go! Woo! I got these cool things from um, Morrison's. They were two for two pounds. So Alice has got one. And it's just something they can both do. Not too hard, is it? Okay. Count. Three. Three, go. Go. Woo, that was good. So we're home, it is half past three. Just picked up some parcels. We've got a Tassimo order. We've got breakfast box, which was, I think that was a freebie one. And then I also got some stuff for Violet from the Bow Boutique. So that's exciting. I'll show you what I got. You okay, mister? What's that for? Okay, so for granolas, I got the, I think she's outside, Alistair. I got the Peaches Provencal, which peach, apricot, and orange granola. I've never had that one, that looks nice. Bramley, Bramble Country, um, apple, blackberry, and roasted hazelnut muesli. Haven't had that one either. Honey Hunter, honey baked oats with pecan almonds and walnuts and hazelnuts. That sounds really good. And then I got the orange and macadamia. I actually really didn't really like this one last time. So I'm going to have to put, because you can actually say whether you like them or not. And I need to say that I don't like it. So yeah, I got those. And then for my Tassimo, I got my chai lemongrass. I haven't had this in ages and I really like it. It's really nice. 
I got Cadbury's because Graham loves that. I got Hag Creamer Coffee, which is a really nice coffee. It doesn't come with milk or anything, but it's really, really nice with our raw milk. Um, I got Oreo, which is a new one. I couldn't wait to try that, and I think Graham's going to love that. Um, I got this one. I haven't tried this one before. This one's the creme brulee um, kind of latte. And then the caramel latte is one of my favourites. And then I got the Jacobs, uh, this is the, the basically the same, la latte macchiato, but it's um, a low sugar one, so I thought that would be a good alternative, um, just to see what it tastes like, because these ones are like super duper sweet. So right now I'm going to water my plants, they're doing really well actually, my, um, it's amazing how you plant like one little flower and it blossoms into like craziness, but I love Look, it. And Yep, yeah, I'll have that in a minute bye. And then I planted some more tomatoes here because I've got loads of tomato plants and Violet's been loving tomatoes. So yeah, hopefully they will survive because sometimes when you bring them out too early, they, they get a bit upset. But my other tomatoes growing really well. I've got some little tomatoes and you can see them growing. So that's cool. You can see them all flowering. Wow. They're just underneath, Alistair. They're, um, they're a bit green at the moment, so they're not ready yet. But I'm just going to water them all. Kitties have got ice poles. And then I've got my bag. And I'm going to clean out the car. Because it's utter mess, isn't it? Give my time to chill out. I've done the car. I haven't hoovered it, but it's clean. I literally pulled out, like, a bin bag I worth of rebels. rubbish. I fed the lammies. I watered the plants. Now it's time to sit down. <laughs> I'm tired now. Ten past four. Alistair is I there, weeding bubbles. for me. While it's here. Bubbles. Oh, his brother got the bubbles, is he? What's he doing? Yeah, I fed the lammies. The lammies are here. I um, I thought they were going to go in with the chicken, but apparently they're still a bit too small because they might get try and get through the fence because uh, one side is like barbed wire and it's just it's not really safe to risk it. Noisy <laughs> beds. Alice has turned his bubbles into a lightsaber. Hmm. It's interesting. Bubbles weren't good enough, no? Apparently he used them up, so. Looks a bit dirty. Did you just put dirt in there? Yeah. Yeah? To make a lightsaber. Mm. That was literally a five minute sit down. Violet just keeps on on about getting bubbles out, so get the bubble machine out. Make it happy, then I can sit down on the lounger because actually sitting on grass like long grass is actually really itchy oh i want to show you our frogs should we show them our frogs yeah. we've got lots of frogs i think we've got about who? six or seven now who show them frogs show the camera look can you see them they're tiny uh, tiny little baby frogs i'll give one to them give one to them uh, look aren't they cute oh you're trying to look through <laughs> They're cute. Yeah. Tiny little things. There we go. Bubbly bubbly, is that okay? Happy? Happy? Pop, pop, pop. Pop those bubbles. There we go. That's a lot easier than blowing them, isn't it? Boo! <laughs> Were you singing a song for your babies? Yeah. Yeah. Twinkle. You're singing Twinkle Twinkle? Yeah. Very good. You're going to get dressed, monkey. Uh oh no! Uh oh. Never. Uh oh. The battle of getting dressed every morning is pretty much the same every morning. Oh dear, never mind. He's only got today and tomorrow, so... Yeah, it's not the end of the world, is it? Once he gets to school, he loves it because he sees all his friends, but it's just getting the dress part is the bit that he hates. I'm just going to get some clothes out for Violet. Mm -hmm. We just got back from the school run and we've actually got, um, we're looking after Graham's mum's dogs. While she's in Ireland doing a um, flower arranging thing. So we've got mm -hmm. Popo, which is Apollo, mm -hmm. and we've got Smud, which is Donk's sister. They look like twinsies. We call them the terrible twins because they're awful together. So, yeah. Donk, smudge, pickles. Smudgy's a sweetheart though, aren't you? You're a sweetheart. So yeah, I just got back from the school run and I'm just literally about to hop in the shower. Today is probably going to be a little bit of a boring one. I probably won't be able to feel much. I usually work, but I'm not working because my mum's um, got a week off and um, she's arranged stuff to do stuff this week. So... 
I'm not working this week, but um, I've actually got to take Graham's gran um, to get fitted for her, like a recliner chair to be made for her. So I need to take her all the way to Paul and then I'm going to take her for lunch after because she doesn't really get out of the house much. It would be nice for her to get out with Violet. So yeah, that's the plan for today. I'm just going to hop in the shower because I feel all yucky and my hair needs a good wash. We are headed out. It's nearly half past ten. Hi everyone. So it's half past one. We've just got home. We dropped grandma off. We went for lunch, which is really nice. I had like a massive bacon and brie panini, which was just huge. Um, I couldn't even eat it all. And then Violet had like a ham sandwich platter with like fruit and cucumber and what else did she have some crispies and yeah it was really nice um yeah we just dropped grandma home obviously she got her chair ordered her one and violet's actually i get some popo red you're giving popo the red you lucky popo she brought some ham sandwich especially back for the dogs which was really sweet Papa. good boys they just keep whining though you miss your mummy don't you you miss your mummy, Popo. So we're just headed down to see Graham on the farm. He's actually making, because obviously I wasn't working today. He's had to kind of do a bit of my work, which is a shame. Um, I've kind of given him a little bit of work. But um, he's in the cutting room. They're cutting up meat today. And um, he's making skewers. Why do you got purple flowers? They're pretty, aren't they? They're wildflowers, like. Yeah, yeah, um, so yeah, we're going to go see him and just tell him about his gran and... Um, I think his dad might be down there as well. Yes, bye. You like purple flowers. You like purple flowers. I do too. Yep. It's like your pretty flower in your hair. Uh -huh. Where's your daddy? Tell him about grandma. What did grandma have for lunch? What did she have? Salmon. She had an egg sandwich, didn't she? Yeah. Yeah. And she had a lemonade. Hello. <laughs> Lammy's out there grazing with the chickens. <laughs> Is that nice? Is that good? You've got lots of stuff to eat. Look at their tummies. They're getting huge. Why are we Why are Hi everyone. Sorry, I've been really preoccupied. I've been publishing a few things. Just trying to sort out my sister's birthday's coming up and I'm trying to sort out a spa day and trying to get a good deal because spa days can be so expensive and honestly, you really don't need to pay that much. Um, so I'm trying to sort out a spa day and also I really want to learn how to surf and they've got a special deal on at the moment in Bournemouth um, on Groupon and I'm trying to get my friends to do it with me because obviously I don't want to do it on my own so um, yeah really randomly I want to just I just you know give it a try I love the sea and it would just be fun so I'm basically just yeah browsing the yeah. internet trying to find some good deals Bailey's here she wants to take her scooter to school don't you Oh, you got your shoes on the wrong feet? No. No? Are you sure? No. Never mind. So, yeah, we're going to... It's half past two, so we're going to leave in a minute to go pick up the boy from school. And we'll probably come home and not do much else, to be honest. It's just one of those days where it's just... End of the week, everyone's feeling tired. What would you like? Ice lollies. You want an ice lolly? Yep. Yeah. Um, go swimming. We go swimming? Yep. Anything else? Go to bed? No. No. <laughs> it's the morning. In the morning? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Flower. Flower, yeah. Right, should we go? Yep. Okay, let's scootering to school to get brother. Come on. Oh, let's just scooter. Right, let's go home. So we're at home now, finally. We made it. So hot. The kiddies are like, guys, lollies. I'm in the pool. <laughs> he won't get in the pool. So I've started dinner. It's, it's actually 25 to 6. We've been chilling out outside in the garden. Kids have been in the pool pretty much the whole time. Graham's just got in, which is early. I suppose you haven't even seen him this week because he's actually been getting in really, really late. I've barely seen him. He's coming for dinner and then he's gone back out again um, because he's been silage making, baling and wrapping, which is just takes such a long time. And while it's dry, you've got to get it done like all in one hit. 
So I've barely seen him this week, which is annoying. But um, yeah, he's out with the kids at the moment, just out the front getting the scooters in. But I've started dinner. I'm actually doing um, basically spaghetti bolognese, but I'm gonna I'm doing it with turkey mint instead. Um, I'm just gonna put some spinach in. Header it. Morning everyone, we are having breakfast. It's nearly no, seven o'clock. Um, Both kiddies are actually uh, up for a change at the same time. <laughs> You're crazy. Alistair's actually on his second breakfast, aren't you? Eight. Yeah. Um, he's had Rice Krispies, now he's having Weetabix and he's had a bowl of fruit. And I haven't even sat, well I'm just sat down now just to have mine. I'm having a chai latte which I haven't had in months, which is so nice, it's so sweet, um, but really, really nice. And then I'm just having my Grace Wax granola with extra fruit. And then I need to pack school lunches, or pack my Alice's school lunch. He's actually got a school, non-school uniform day today, so he can go in his normal clothes, which he's super happy about. And then I'll be getting myself ready and off to work because Graham takes the kids uh, to nursery and school on Friday, which is quite handy really. And he really enjoys it, just doing it once a week. All right, I am off to work. It's 10 to eight. It's a little bit earlier than usual because, um, well, the person that actually, oh, really cute green bed then. Um, the person that actually does the market, he's, I don't know, he's not very punctual and I kind of got to get, get there a little bit earlier just to get his butt in gear basically. So, um, yeah, <laughs> so yeah, I'm leaving at 10 to 8, only a little bit early, not much. And yeah, I'll see you later. It's going to be a really nice warm day today, which is good. And yeah, I'm only here till about half past 11. So, um, because I've got to meet up with one of the bridesmaids and we're trying on bridesmaid shoes. So that should be interesting. Hi everyone, so I finished my market. I actually finished at quarter past 11. I've just parked and I'm actually going to get some lunch and meet um, one of the bridesmaids and we're gonna try on some bridesmaid shoes. Obviously the other two girls, they live at quite a distance to us, so they're kind of going on our recommendations, but it's so hot. The car's reading about 24 degrees today, so it's really, really nice and warm. I'm really hungry though, so I'm gonna get some lunch before I meet her. And yeah, I've got to get Violet at half one, the usual. And yeah, I'll probably see you in a bit. Okay, I'm headed home. Um, it's 10 to one now. We sorted out shoes, although we didn't really sort them out. Um, the color, we're going with like a company called Rainbows or like Rainbow Shoes. Um, you've probably heard of them. It's quite a big company and they basically dye a shoe to a certain color that you need. And the only problem is, is that the navy blue that they have, which they char they don't charge extra for, is so different to our navy blue dresses, and is twenty five pounds uh, per like pair of shoes if you want the exact match. So we are so debating. It's just oh, we've got ten months, so we're in no rush, and the bride is in a rush though. She's in such a rush, and I don't know why. We've got so much time. But anyway, it was nice to meet up and we had lunch. I had a really nice um, smoked salmon and cream cheese sandwich. And I've actually taken a brownie home as well. So it be something nice to have when I get home. Um, yeah, it's 10 to one. I've got to pick up Violet at half past one. I'm getting stuck in a little bit of traffic and I'm not sure why. Um, so likelihood, I'll probably end up picking her on, up on the way home now. So we are home finally. It feels like it's been such a long day. It's quarter to two. Oh, I can't believe I'm actually, cons well, totally going out tonight. I've already said I'm going out, so I've got no choice in that matter. I, obviously, I will enjoy it when I'm out, but right now I'm feeling totally drained. Um, I picked up some more fruit from at the market. There's a fly in here. It's really bugging me. Um, I'm gonna sit down with a coffee. It's, yeah, it's quarter to two, so I've got to get Alistair in about 45-ish minutes. I'll leave a little bit earlier so Violet can have a nap. Violet! I really need to empty the dishwasher. I really need to water my plants, but I really can't be bothered. <laughs> so, 
So are you doing it nursery? Let's have a look. <gasps> That's lovely, Violet. That's really good. I did it outside the nursery. You did it outside? You do all your crafts outside, don't you, in the summer? Look at pink. Pink and red and lots of glitter and sparkles. Oh, shishums. Who's making that racket? Who's making Is that you, Popo? Is that you, Biggles? It's not you, is it? <laughs> Having a good cuggle. Oh, yuck. Licky, licky dogs. I got some more fruit from the market today. I got two lots of strawberries, some flat peaches. Violet, do you want a flat peach? We've got some pears, asparagus, new potatoes, and some little mini peppers. So I'm going to have a brownie and sit down and um, check my emails and just chill out with Vi. Vi's on her second flat peach because she absolutely loves them. I have to get brother soon, so we're just going to chill for a bit. I haven't sat down all day apart from when I have my lunch, so yeah, time to chill, isn't it, Vi? Vi looks really tired as well. So no rest for the wicked at all because we've actually arranged to go to one of our lo local tea rooms and have a nice walk through the new forest. <laughs> Why did we arrange it? <coughs> With two of Alistair's little buddies and obviously their mums and they've both got siblings so yeah so no rest for me all day. Don't we do it. It'd be good fun though. Don't we do Kids it. have a nice walk and I got them a couple of little treats um, for on our little walk so to, you know just as a nice little treat because they had a um bailey in this um where we had our shoes like this like bridal shop not even a bridal shop it's basically like a shoe shop um there's a, a really lovely sweet shop like right next to it and like a really old traditional sweets so i picked up some little like i don't know little sweets for the kids so None, none for us mummies though. I didn't think about us for some reason. Never mind. Yes, Violet. I want daddy. You want daddy? But well, daddy's working, isn't he? He's busy. Want brother. You want brother? Yeah. We're gonna get brother. Hey everyone. So we've been back for about ten minutes. I've just the kids are still outside playing. They're actually playing there where the doggies are. You can see Violet in the back. Um. Yeah, it's it's really late actually. It's 25 to 6. I say late, it's not that late, but I'm actually going out at 8 o'clock, so I need to get a move on and get dinner done. Like I said, I'm not doing anything, you know, cooking-wise. It's really, really easy. But, oh, I just feel absolutely shattered. I'm sorry if this day has been extremely boring. It's just one of those days where it's just, like Fridays are just my go, go, go days. I just literally am just busy, busy throughout the whole day. Um, and it doesn't help me actually going out this evening, but I know, like I said, I know I'm going to enjoy it once I am out. Once I have a shower, refresh up and just put some makeup on and look nice, I'll be happy to go out. I haven't seen or heard from Graham all day, so I have no clue where he is, what he's doing. <sighs> but it's just what it's like most days anyway. So I'm just going to start on dinner. Um, I'm doing, I've defrosted some frozen prawns, they're already cooked. So we're just going to have a prawn feta cheese lentil salad. Really quick, easy, tasty, the kids will love it. They love prawns, they love cheese, they love lentils, whatever. Throw it all together, it's going to be really easy. <laughs> and um, it involves no cooking, which is good. There's our simple thrown together dinner for tonight, that's mine. Mine's a bit more colourful than Graham's. <laughs> right. Everything is cleaned up. Alice is having a meltdown. Graham's take it over, which is good because I need time to zen out and have a shower. <laughs> I literally just shut the door. So you just think, I'm tired. I need to get ready and you can take over. It's the way it should be, right? Parents equal, that sort of thing. So I'm going to have a shower, sort myself out and get ready for tonight. Sure. What sort of picture are you doing? I thought you were writing me a letter. Hmm? I want to write study, Baba. Okay. Where's my picture? I don't know. Oh! <laughs> I know. So I'm pretty much ready. I just need to choose what I'm going to wear. I've done my hair, done my makeup, and it's half past seven. Kitty's be going to bed in a minute, and I'll be leaving at eight o'clock, so... 
yeah, I can't wait. I'm actually really looking forward to it now. Um, now I've refreshed and sort of done myself up a bit. It just makes you feel a bit more ready and prepared to go out. Um, yeah, so I hope you've enjoyed this week. I hope it hasn't been too long because I know these weekly vlogs can be super long. Um, the dogs are going crazy outside. But yeah, so I will see you all soon.